Good morning to all. I am Raja Lakshmi, Assistant Professor of Statistics, Department of Mathematics, KSR College of Arts and Science for Women, Tirchungur. Today our topic is Analysis of Variance, which is ANOVA. In this, we have Experimental Design. Investigator controls one or more independent variables called treatment variables or factors contain two or more levels. Observes effect on dependent variable. Response to levels of independent variable. Experimental design. Plan used to test statistics or hypothesis. Parametric test procedures. Involve population parameters. Example, population mean. Require interval scale or ratio scale. Whole numbers or fractions. Example, height in inches 72, 60.5. 54.7 like this have straightened assumptions examples normal distribution homogeneity of variance examples is a test t test next non parametric test procedures statistic does not depend on population distribution data may be nominally or ordinarily scaled examples gender which is female or male, birth order. May involve population parameters such as median. Example, Wilcoxon rank some test. Next, advantages of non-parametric tests. Used with all scales. Easier to compute. Developed before wide computer use. Make fewer assumptions. Need not involve population parameters. Results may be as exact as parametric procedures. Next, disadvantages of non-parametric tests, which is may waste information if data permit using parametric procedures, example, converting data from radio ratio to ordinal scale. Difficult to compute by hand for large samples. Tables not widely available. Next, in this we have ANOVA. What is ANOVA? Analysis of variance, which is, in this we have to see one way, one factor, completely randomized designs, CRD, completely randomized design. Experimental units are assigned randomly to treatments. Subjects are assumed homogeneous. One factor or independent variable which is two or more treatment levels or classifications analyzed by one way and two way ANOVA. Mini case. After working for the Jones Graphics company for one year, we have the choice of being paid by one of three programs, commission only, fixed salary or combination of the two. Salary plans, commission only, fixed salary, combination of the two. So next, is the average salary under the various plans different? Assumptions, homogeneity of variance, normality, additivity, independence. Homogeneity of variance, variances associated with each treatment in the experiment are, are equal. Normality. Each treatment population is normally distributed. What is additivity? The effects of the model behave in an additive fashion. Example, SST is equal to SSB plus SSW. Non-additivity may be caused by the multiplicative effects existing in the model, exclusion of significant interactions or by outliers. Observations that are inconsistent with major response in the experiment. Independence. Assuming the treatment populations are normally distributed, the errors are not correlated. One way ANOVA compares two types of variation to test equality of means, ratio of variances in comparison basis if treatment variation is significantly greater than random variation then means are not equal. Variation measures are obtained by partitioning total variation. 
so this is the one way ANOVA table source of variation sum of squares degrees of freedom mean square between treatments SSB sum of squares then degrees of freedom C minus 1 mean square is nothing but SSB divided by degrees of freedom which is C minus 1 like this we have to calculate one way so uh, like one way ANOVA we have to calculate two way also thank you